All right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Mafia Definitive Edition. I don't know, I think this might be towards the end of the game. We might, like, we might be getting We're done with it soon. This. Keep your yep. head. We gotta get to the theater before the show's over. Tom, you're driving. I figured. We got the word, boys. Morello dies tonight. Tonight? Shit. Good luck, guys. Do I have, uh, should I go see Vinny? No, he's out here. He's not going to be of any help. But yeah, I think we might be able to finish the game off today. I don't know. Put your foot down, Tom. Can't believe after all these years we're finally going after Morello. Not his crew, not his family. Finally putting him in the ground. We're putting a lot of history to rest. What happens when he's gone? We'll be kings. Nah, I mean, what happens with the Don? You think he'll be all tore up? I think he'll start wearing a nice white suit. <laughs> like Morello does, yeah, I'll think so. You boys doing all right? Yeah, just sweating bullets. You look how I feel. Nearly there. Let's keep it together. When we see him, go for Morello. No one else. Once he's down, his guys will panic. We're actually doing this. He's been up against the boss for what, 10 years? More. You'd think that white suit would make him an easier target. Guess not. People who you think would be the easiest usually try to stay behind. Sit in the shadows and whatnot. I see him! Let him have it! Go! Go! After him! Chase him down, Tom! That shit was a setup. When I get close, shoot for the cars protecting it. Let's get him out of the picture. You got it. We got cops on us. A bunch of them were staked out around the theater. Last yep, time they're they protecting get paid him. off by Morello. Tomorrow, they're ours. Shit, this rate's taking too much. Oh, God. These guys are out of force. Take yeah, off definitely. Morello's the price tonight. We got him on the ropes. He's already running, and his guys are behind. If we lose him, we'll go to ground for months. More, maybe. Don't let him give us a slip. He could be headed anywhere. He's right there. He's probably headed to the airport. Him. He might even move out of state for a while. We need to whack him tonight. Get him the fuck off us. Come on, speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Going through Chinatown. If he stops anywhere else, we can. He's trying surround. to shake us off in the back streets. I know this city better than anyone. Don't worry. Come on, Come on fellas. We're taking this city over. There he is. Wait, 
until we get a little closer, boys. Ah, oh, shit, more cops. Does he have the entire city police force on his payroll or something? Can y'all take care of them, please? Ah, oh, jeez, these guys don't give up! Neither do we. We're taking this all the way. If he gets to the airport, we can at least kill him before he gets to a plane. We're catching up. We're catching up. Where is he going? He can't be skipping town with us going bumper to bumper with him. Well, wherever he's going, he's going there in a hurry. We're it's trying. The strip. He's gonna go through the back. He's got a plane? Of course he's got a goddamn plane. There'll be more guys waiting. Good! We need to clean house! He's gotta die? This guy's gotta die! Okay, but let's keep us three off your list. They only just fixed up the airport since the last time. He's got muscle waiting! I see him! Yeah, I'm all right. Uh, just a bit of glass in my hair. Not that a cheap comb can't fix. Then we go after him on foot. Come on. <coughs> Let's move. There's no end to these guys. Where the hell was that bastard hiding? <laughs> Where's the rest of them? Have a taste of this! Tommy, look out! What are they flanking from behind? Here we go. Together. They got a new guy coming. Oh. Damn it. Is he still alive? No, he's not. Alright, where where is he at? Got a new guy! He's down. Where's the other one? There's one more. Draw him out a little bit. Gotcha now. Okay. Help me. Okay, we're done here. We're good. Grenades. Don't rest in it! Crew's coming in! 
In that hangar. Over here. Tommy, look out. Got a new guy. Tommy, look out. New goon inbound. Come on, come on. There we go. You like that? Eat this. Holy crap. There we go. Throw. Who's left? Where's the other guy? Damn it! Quit! Dick! Thank you! Who's next? One less asshole. Got him. Up here. He ain't getting back up. Got him. Jeez, got to reload. There we go. Oh shit, the plane's up. Plane's coming up. Okay, come on, get up. No, 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 no. Go, go, go. Move. Get us into the air. We don't have the speed. Take us up. It's going to take off. Shoot out the engines. What do you think Are I'm trying to do? It it's no good! This isn't gonna work! It has to work! He's in a fucking plane! Can't Keep her steady! He's not out of here yet! Damn it. Okay. We're good. We can we can bring him down. It's gonna take off! Shoot out the engines! Are we even making it get? It's no good! Okay! Now the other! Blow them both! This isn't gonna work! It there are two work. other of you in the car! Somebody Please. else needs to shoot. Cannot let me shoot. He's not out of here yet. There I'm we go. Taking the wheel. Why? Cuz I'm the guy that drives. And now we got a plane to catch. Okay, here's what's happening. We follow him. We see where it lands. We rush in all guns blazing and we finish him off. No way that bird's staying in the sky. That thing's not gonna... Anyway, that thing's not gonna land, it's gonna crash! It look, uh, aeronautic to you? Thank Christ we got you in the car, Professor. Morello's <laughs> not gonna walk away from a plane crash. That's a maybe, but he ain't dead till we've seen him dead. Out of all of us, you two should know that by now. And the word is aerodynamic, Bobby. Where is he trying to take it? Maybe out near the racetrack. More chance of landing it safe outside the city. Hell are maybe, but it's not going to be safe. Wherever he comes down, we'll be there soon after. All cars, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. Okay. Plus, we can still follow the remnants of the uh, is it gonna go? smokestack. Yep. Yeah, it's going. We need to get there and cap them before the police show up. The 
but we don't have time to relax. We gotta be sure he's dead before the cops show. No one's gonna survive that! Hell of a lot of smoke. I can't believe we did this. I know. Don't seem real. Stay alert with your guns close. We've come too far to get lazy at the end. We don't have long. Every cop in the city is gonna be on his way. We get out, we check the wreckage, we leave. Got it? Sure we do. Right up here. What's with you today, Tom? What the fuck? I can't crack. Okay, whatever. Daddy doesn't even know it yet. He knows it now. Yeah, pal. That'll do it. Come on. Let's make tracks. See you on the other side, Marku. All right, we did it. What's next? fucking phantom I've been chasing you for three goddamn years you do life for this Tom maybe you in the chair you don't want the guy who was punching tickets you want the guy who was handing them out so that's what this has been all about huh you offering up Salieri the Don's books the ones Frank stole I have them they're enough to put Salieri away forever and they're yours Assuming we have a deal. My family for the Don. You recognize anyone? Look again. Old man, that's Don Popone, two younger lads of Morello and Salieri. Yeah. Okay, I see it. That must be what? 1920? April. Morello's wedding. Salieri was the best man. Jesus. They're just kids. Not already soldiers in Popone's mob. So what happened? How did they go from being best mates to Morello on a slab? I don't know. I didn't even know they were friends. <laughs> but you don't know could fill up the fucking crash they're building. Jeez. In 22, Papone drowns up at the lake. In order to keep things running smoothly, Salieri and Morello agreed to debut up the city. Yeah, I heard the story, so what? Well, their friendship should have made the deal work, but... Didn't make a lick of difference. After Morello, Salieri was beaming, thinking we ran the whole damn town. Me, I was just happy the war was over. But then I got to thinking about something. What good? 
Mike was all of Morello's money if it couldn't protect him from a regular Joe like me. Cabby, for Christ's sake. It only got him one thing. A great big bullseye in his fucking forehead. And that thought... It just kept turning round and round in my head until one day... I'm looking in a mirror. I start seeing a bullseye too. Right here. Dry your tears in the water hundreds, do you? I wasn't about to give up the good life, I know that. I just told myself that I was smarter than Morello. That I wouldn't turn around one day and find Polly or Sam pointing a gun at my head. The thing is, you don't see it. When you're out on the street, scrapping, fighting for your life, then the guy next to you isn't just your partner. He's your brother. You'd stick a knife in someone for your brother, right? But at night, you lie awake, wondering what he and Adon were whispering about behind the bar. Wondering if your best friend is hungry enough to betray you. That's gotta be a hell of a thing. I mean, it's not something you commonly think about, but in that line of work, definitely. Or just what happens if one of them is ordered to put one in your head and you, you don't know whether or not they're going to go through with it. Any trouble? No bus, no trouble at all. Got something else for me? All these feels a little light. There's a little extra in mind to cover the difference. You ever go swimming, Tom? Been to the shore a few times, sure. I know a couple of guys once. Took some dames out to the lake. Had a few beers, a few laughs. Then one of them decides to go in the water. Gets to the center of the lake and realizes he's running out of steam. Can't make it back in. He starts shouting for help. Now the other guy, he's a strong swimmer. He goes out in the lake to drag his buddy back to shore. Problem is, the first guy, the one too stupid to know when the water's too deep for him, he panics. Grabs his friend by the neck and they both go under and don't come up again. Paulie's your friend, and I know you're loyal to him, and I respect that. But don't you ever pay his tab again. Okay, boss. Good. Now, we gotta talk about this Turnbull. The guy running for governor? The same. He's been flapping his gums a lot about cracking down on our businesses. <laughs> That's rich. He spent more on whores than Paulie and Sam combined. <laughs> you want me to pay him a visit? Maybe put him on a take? No. You can't trust a hypocrite, Tom. We need to end his campaign aspirations, and in a way that keeps anyone from stepping up to the same platform. Vinny have a plan then? Of course. Turnbull's holding a rally near Central Island. The spot he picked is hard to reach and out in the open. Should have a beautiful view of the rally from the tower of the old prison. From there, you can give Turnbull the third eye. Okay. I'll go see Vinny about the gun. But don't forget, you only got one shot. You miss, and his crew will usher him out of there quick. I'm the best shooter you got. Otherwise, you'll be talking to someone else. Then get it done. All right. That's... Hey, handsome. Hello there, ladies. Smoking You're wasted for. on that wife of yours. You know that? Uh, he'll never look our way. He's a good boy. Thank you. There's something up here I wanted to see. But what is that? Two politicians we've murdered? Or one and a half because we haven't killed this one yet? Hey, Tom. 
You're missing this idiot being partway through one of his bullshit stories. Since when have I told you bullshit stories? Like the one about the Goomba who shot himself in the face? Hey, No Nose was a hell of a guy. You would have liked him. I'm not look at, but uh, he had a sense <laughs> okay. of Okay. Well, that was sort of a but. Or needed maybe it's in one of these other did. rooms. I know there's, like, a way to change clothes. But I guess you can't do that during a mission, so let's go downstairs and talk to Vinny. Knock, knock, Vinny! Hey, Tommy. Boss says you got something for me. Yeah, I got a shipment in from a guy at Fort Stanmore. Now, Salieri wants this to run like clockwork, so no heat to the guy's head bursts. I hit little Tony, stash one of these, where you need it. So, up high in the old prison? Yeah. Family's got a lot of history in that place. Hoods who live there now ain't so classy. So watch yourself. Little Tony locked the rifle up tight in the room with a view. Up on the top floor. All right. Sick of that politician shit in the papers, Tommy. We own this town now. Right between the eyes, huh? Find a way inside and make for the guard tower. The top deck is locked. That's what the key's for. And we'll grab the Tommy gun and a knife. Oh, shit. Hold on one second. Sorry about that. Dealing with allergies is a bitch. Okay, so let's grab a car and get to the prison. I want something fast. You know what? Let's try this. This tacky, straight silver number. Just look at this thing. Like, why would they give Morello's car to Tommy? Although it should be pretty fast. Got a nice horn. He gave us the slip nearly a couple of times, so... I mean, seriously. Like, I guess you see it pretty often in, like, when you, uh... When you go on to GTA Online with, like, people with chromed out, uh, cars and shit. But, who would really want an all chrome or all silver car? Plus, I think it's a safety hazard, isn't it? Like, a sunny day, su sun shines right down on it and it just blinds everything in its path. Big house is ours now. What the hell are you talking about? Hey, fella. Come over. What's up, buddy? You with Tony? Yep. Yeah. Your friend said you wanted the guard tower. Bade me to mark the way with his sign. Folks go through the sewer. Only way. Then just keep heading up. Okay. Seems like they fucked up this place, so why can't you just make your own door? Hey, get out of here! We ain't going nowhere! I ain't trying to make you go anywhere, shut up. Dead end. Let's 
gotta be this way. Have you seen my rat? No, I have not. And it's time for me to turn around. Someone's coming through. No. Well, you ain't one of us. You're not welcome here. I'm warning you, mister. You should have left me alone. Oh, that's a dead end, so we gotta go this way. And up we go. Oh, that's right, you gotta climb up. Push a button to climb a ladder. Why can't you people just leave us be? What the hell are you talking about? This is our home. Why can't you people understand that? I'm not trying to evict you. Is that you, cop? You're locked up tight, not getting in. Someone's coming through. Security procedure. Wait, what does that say? Lost Heaven typewriter is some our lullaby, I think. I I don't I don't understand that. Having fun? Oh no, he's vomiting. Turn around. Lost. Uh, help? You know the guard tower? It's uh, up through the main cell block. Gates locked most of the time. Keep the feds out. Thanks. Be careful in here, stranger. We're protective of our own. That's fine. That's very fine. I lost my arm in France for this? Damn. Damn. A World War One vet. What the hell? What is this ammo? I went the wrong way. Through here? Somebody really wanting to challenge me? Where to next? Hey, who's this? This is not a gate, these are all cells. Oh, oh. Still going up. There's that hole. Excuse me, you wanna fuck off? Alright, just you and me. Ah, Jesus. That is just unsettling. Hit it. Hit it. There you go, Tommy. I gotta... I gotta press it again? There's a comic book over here. Somewhere... It's in this one. Detective Magazine. Here. 
What's in here? I thought there'd be more of you to evict us. I'm not here to evict you. I just want to know where the guard tower Quite is. Quite close to the guard tower. Real close. Elevator's out, but you can take the stairs. Sounds good. through here. Oh, just another door? And let there be light. Now all we gotta do is find the gun. I don't know why the music has grown intense, but... Oh shit, look at that blimp, it's so close. There's the pavilion. And here's the rifle. Just in case. How the hell do you know that? Oh, jeez. That's a creepy doll. Don't like that. Never will. Is this a door out? Ah. What's this? L okay, list of executions. Oh, that's the electric chair. <laughs> Holy shit. The shot came from up here. The chief said he was declared dead at the scene. <clears throat> well, let's pick him up. Some inside. There you go. Have a good night. No, I wanted the thank you. The moment where you open that door, it's gonna be uh, guns blazing. <sighs> Maybe not. Detain everyone you see. The police! It's the police! Right through here. Oh no! Oh no! There we go. Let's 
city been trying to get people to leave here for a while. Okay. Oh, they know. They know. Give up. You're surrounded. You can't escape turnbull with a good man. Hit it. Good man. Get that aside. Damn it. Hit it! Hit it! Quickly! Out we go! In the car. We've got a roadblock set up. Just slow him down. <laughs> oh god, they're gonna try to box me in. There we go. Grit. Why not? No, 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 no! Oh, shit. I have no clue why the sound messed up right there. Getting them all in a nice big cluster, fuck. <sighs> Might get them off me for a little bit. Excuse me. Officers on Central Island. Suspect has been lost. Keep patrolling. Please try to look at my sequence. Yeah, be busy. Go get him, boys. Right, I need to get across the bridge. Uh, they're closing in. I think they popped one of my tires. Yep. All cars, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. <laughs> All right. Sweet, sweet God, that was a little rough of an escape.
Did you hear about this Turnbull? Heard he was crooked as the day is long. It says in the paper he's going to be remembered for fighting to pass the 19th Amendment. Put his whole Shit. career on the line for it. Which one was that again? Woman suffrage, you idiot. He gave me the right to vote, Tom. Gave it to his wife and six daughters, too. Guess nobody's just one thing, are they? Guess not. I gotta go to work. <sighs> Tom. Don't do nothing you don't want to be remembered for, you hear me? Probably too late for that. <laughs> Holy shit, okay. Fuck me. <laughs> 19th Amendment. Shit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, uh, when we return, we're gonna see what Just for Relaxation is all about, and, uh, and then see what else the game has for us. So thank you so much for watching, and I will be back in a moment. Mm -hmm.